Hi everyone, um, as uh, it's school holidays in Australia, so all the children they are at home and uh, they, they want different snacks and because of school holidays we are planning to go on camping and we, uh, I thought that I will make some burfi as a dessert that we can use um, during our stay <clears throat> in, during our stay there. It is a very simple recipe just um, one two three just four ingredients and it's easy to make and very quick like it's re it gets ready in a couple of hours time so whatever time requires it's in for freezing uh, otherwise the preparation time is very little it's only like 10 12 minutes um, and then the it's like one hour one and a half hour is the freezing time so in nowadays when most of the moms both the parents are working and it is very hard for us to um, cook different snacks for our children at home which is a healthy way sometimes we uh, run out of time and we buy it from the shops which is not very healthy for them to eat so I it's always my preference it's always um, I always try to um, make the recipes which are very quick and easy to make in which we don't have to spend a lot of time in cooking in the kitchen so this recipe is one of them and um, as you will see you will realize that it's really quick and whenever your uh, children your family wants uh, something sweet um, as burpee is a very um, a, a, a very popular sweet in india so when you go through the recipe as you see when i will make you will find it that um, it's a really simple easy to make and quick so whenever your family wanted you can just make it straight away for them or if you have some guests coming over you don't have much at home and you don't want to spend a lot of time in cooking as um, when we are free when it's our day off we want to spend time with our family as well not in the kitchen all the time so um, but at the same time we want to cook uh, for our children for our family so um, you will see that it's, it's really a good recipe and uh, if you like it please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel so let's get start the ingredients that we require to make um, mava and cashew burfi are as follows 300 ml of fresh cream one tin of condensed milk and it is 397 grams so around 400 grams a tin of condensed milk then I have taken one and a half cup of milk powder and half cup of cashew powder if you are allergic with nuts you can replace it with the milk powder so you can instead of taking one and a half cup of milk powder you can have two cups of milk powder like if you eat gluten free or if you're allergic with nuts so here I have taken one and a half cup of milk powder and half a cup of cashew nuts powder instead you can take two cups of milk powder and the other ingredients will remain the same 300 ml um, cream and one tin one small 400 grams tin of condensed milk that's all we need for burfi I will start uh, mixing them now in a container the microwave safe container so I will add first milk powder and the cashew nut powder all the four ingredients just straight away put it in your baking uh, sorry oven safe tray pour in there condensed milk and 
and it's a 600 ml bottle so I'm gonna use half of it I make it very often so I just have the idea how much the 300 grams will be and mix it nicely that's So now I'm going to put this mixture in the microwave for all together for 10 minutes but I will keep on checking and uh, stirring it every two to three minutes when it comes to boil on top. Now I can bring it out of the microwave and stir it a little bit and then put it back. has already started thickening abhi aap jaise dekh sakte ho it has started thickening up and another 4 minutes are left so we'll keep it for another 4 minutes I have taken this microwave and it's looking like this. Now I will pour it in a tray. I lined it with the baking paper. leaving the bottom of the dish whichever you are using so it will be clean and that means it's ready to go in the fridge now we need to put it in the tray whatever the thickness you need you can spread it in your tray I like a little bit thick one so I'm not going to make spread it too much. I'll spread it in half of the tray so that I get that desired thickness. Your kids will really appreciate your effort when my children, they do, when they eat the burfi that I prepared when they, when they um, tell me that mom this is the best burfi I have ever eaten or uh, whatever comments beautiful comments out of their mouth it um, increases my motivation and uh, I just love it that's priceless the fridge for um, around one hour one one and a half hour you can uh, see when it's uh, ready if you like at this stage you can uh, garnish it with some pistachios but my children they don't like any nuts on uh, like they, they do eat dry nuts just like that but they don't like it on um, topping or on top of anything so um, okay I'll put it in the fridge and I'll see you in one and a half hour time And it can come out so easily just like that hmm. so now even if you are a working parent you don't have to be disappointed you can still cook for your children and this is how you can make a chutpat burfi for your uh, family so this is how you can have it 
and if you are going at your friend's place and you don't want to buy um, anything from the shop because nothing is good better than homemade so you can pack the sweets in these containers you can buy it from anywhere from Kmart to Dollar Shop or they're not very expensive and you can pack your sweets your homemade sweets uh, that's it for today and i will come up with my another quick chatpat recipe until then bye